We're broadcasting live from Hexon, Texas, home of the spoilers. We're at AK-47 Stadium where the fans are required by law to carry firearms 24-7. So put your bulletproof vests on and let's go, America! Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. The Nashville Lycans battle. The Hexon Oilers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Are you ready for some MFL action? Am I? I love MILFs. Mutants I'd like to fuck. He said MFL, not M-I-L-F, you half-wit. Oh, I thought you were talking about the Mayhem Bowl halftime new lingerie girls team. What a zombie QB with that big rack of ribs and almost no waist at all. First and ten. Looks like a pass. And it's bouncing. And that's a sack. The quarterback has to get rid of the ball there. Second down in a lot. of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest tits? Well. <laughs> Third down and long. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. Third and four. He's got his beast boost working. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. First and two. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a crazy turkey. Shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And 
Giants, first and ten. And the quarterback throws another pick. He that, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. First and ten. Oh my gosh! The defensive play looks like it's a nice catch for five yards. <laughs> Second down and five. <laughs> and that's an incomplete pass. Looks like the defense got away with that one there. Third down and five. <laughs> Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. And it's first and ten. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interception. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. You got to be fucking kidding me. If that's a penalty, they should come up here and penalize us, too. Hey, don't give these refs any ideas, you idiot. Brent, hide the stash. On it. And it's first and goal. Defense had enough with this rep and jumps on sides to kill him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Great throw! Great catch! And then put six points! Look guys, I'm supposed to be impartial, but this ref is so dirty. He should be where he's most at home. Buried in the dirt. First down and long, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice his... And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home 
home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. He grabs it and picks up four on that reception. Second down and six. Just knocked with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwann Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. <laughs> and like Bricks' bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. And it's first and ten. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. The offense is down to their last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. Second down in a very lot. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out in the field, they will have no running plays. And it's first and ten. a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. He picks up a two. Third and four. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. And they'll line up for the punt here. Nice punt. Should move them back nicely. They let the punt drop, and it will be down by the defense. It's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the deep. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. And it's first and ten. Mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Oh, great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. 
second down and ten. A pickup of six yards on the play. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he put all of his foot into that one. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, with a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. In a fight between King Kong and Godzilla, and with another pick, the QB says, I don't know how to throw interceptions, but when I do, he could go all the way. He's at the 40. The 30 might catch him. Move, you fat little mutant. The 10. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. And it's first and ten. Perfect pass and a score! If you think his dancing is bad, you should have been here in the old days. They used to mark their territory the old-fashioned way. But they agreed to dial it down to uh, interpretive dance. I took an interpretive dance class with a werewolf on screen. He damn near clawed my face off! That was before the class even started. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called... S the kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. And that's how you run the football. First down. And it's first and ten. Defensive players go berserk. They've been known to rip. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the line. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Second down and seven. Crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And 
It's first and ten. And he laterals the ball. Man, these guys like playing hot. Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. First down and five. Punishing hit, the quarterback goes down. <laughs> and that'll be second and eight to go. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stop burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. My turn on the one. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? It's first and ten. The quarterback has had enough and caused a murder ball dirty trick to lay. He broke free and has open field in front of him. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. <laughs> First and ten. And he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play. Yeah, it's almost power to grim. Like a high cool. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. It's two yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. Oh, and they just deflated the quarterback's balls right there. We're at the two-minute warning, and we'll take a quick timeout. Graham, will you tell the interns to get us some Frank and dogs and a couple of beers and dry over here? I'll take nachos and a scotch. Uh, we should take a pee for me, too. Caught for the first down. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. 
Under two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And it's first and ten. Air ball! Hey, did we start letting ghosts into the NFL grin? No, that was just a shitty pass to absolutely no one. a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. They stopped the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. Thank you that nine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. And that's the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. Either the defense is trying to keep some time on the clock for their offense, or someone let a real bonehead touch the controller. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. Hey, a sawbuck says he misses. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just getting the points and let's move on. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Second down and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, did he take a punishing hit? You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? Yeah, the waitress at the Boo Hooters chicken wings last night? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, and then, then the police horse is out front in the stadium earlier. It was just a joke slap, but the horse took it seriously. Not surprised. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Second, and that'll be their final timeout. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Bricks' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. I've had it. I'm running up. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Second down and ten. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? Oh, my God, a man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. He's got the distance, and the kick is good! The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where are we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, we're going to go to a strip-tease show? Where are we going? Hey, why don't you settle down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. 
Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck. Oh, with the brain scrambler. First and ten. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo. to remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. Oh. 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 And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life. Or die. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And the defense gets the quarterback for a sack. <laughs> down and forever yeah you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me well you mistaken man you get up my grill I'm gonna ruin your world I'm gonna wreck it And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my offseason. And it's first and ten. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. up a new set of downs oh you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today folks these teams have bad blood between them apparently they got it 
from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. First down and nine. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Since when is that a penalty? Uh, since now, I guess, Ben. And offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down and forever. Defense gave up a lot of yards on that pass play. They'll need to regroup quickly. Second down and seven. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy DeVitt. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Defense is running low on line bashers. They have only two left. They need to play smart from here on out. It's defense, Graham. You're asking too much of them. First and four. the extra point attempt. It's good. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, he should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Stop the show. And it's first and ten. why we love the MFL. <laughs> First down and nine.
Nobody can touch me with eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Oh, he got mugged! More like a mafia hit. And it's first and ten. Freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Now, nah, still working on my salami here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. At this rate, the QB is gonna have more interceptions than. Oh, what a punishing hit that was! And that's how you make... I know how this said never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. The defense has only one line basher left, and they need to keep him alive to avoid forfeiting. First down in inches. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps outside to kill the ref. Oh, ho ho crowd's loving it. First down and three. Second down and nine. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know why. He just made mincemeat out of that guy. Hey, what is me? The defense lost their final line basher. Lucky for them, their offense is out there on the field now where they forfeit. Yeah, they got luck just like Big Ren. I was playing candy crops the other day and I got a cavity with herpes. The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> it was bloody enough for the meat. The Hexon Oilers got it done today. They win by forfeit. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.